Good to see you. Enelroth, Morvane's apprentice. Varel Morvay's been a good master. I like the town and the people. No reason why I wouldn't want to be here for many years, just like the master. Everybody's talking about the Prophet. After the attack on the chapel, people are inclined to believe almost anything. Let's do business. Be seeing you. Varel Morvane. Been making weapons and arms here in Anvil for 30 years. People say I do good work, and I don't aim to argue with them. Been here 30 years, and I expect I'll last another 10 or so. When I'm gone, God's willing, my apprentice, Enelroth, will tend the smithy. The shipmaster. Heinrich Oakenhull has a wood elf for a wife. I'd rather sleep with my horse. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? You got a great deal. You got a great deal there. You drive a hard bargain. Come back and see me again. Good day. Hello. Inneris Inventius, hunter, woodsman, and marksman at your service. Plenty of deer, wolf, boar, mountain lion, bear in the county. Just need to know where to look for them. I don't know what to think about the attack on the chapel. Things seem to go from bad to worse, don't they? You too. Hiding citizen. <laughs> Greetings to you. Go ahead, please. It's unbelievable. Right in the center of the city, nobody saw anything. Makes you wonder about the competence of the guard, if you ask me. He's a most mysterious fellow. In many ways, I admire him. Most of the time, I just feel sorry for him. Goodbye. Is there something I can do for you? My husband is down south in Anvil County, working the Valenwood line, hunting down bandits and smugglers. I still can't believe what happened at the chapel. 
Travaya, Loralthia, Domania, all dead? Farewell. Timothy LaRouche, late of the Black Dog, able seaman. I'll be staying ashore till my stash runs out, then it's off to sea once more. I've gone aground in ports all over the Abyssian Sea, and Anvil's far from the worst. Got the forecastle for my hammock and Mirabelle to keep it warm. Mainland and his brother run a nice establishment at the Flowing Bowl. Be seeing you. What's happening? I heard there was... Jason Sextius, singer, composer, and storyteller extraordinaire. Glad to meet you. I'm currently employed at the Count's Arms, but I'm working on a piece I hope will gain me the patronage of a certain Countess. I don't know what to think about the attack on the chapel. Things seem to go from bad to worse, don't they? I, I Do you need something? Whatever. Didier Ormelie, a ship's clerk. At present, I'm spending my time and gold on the pleasures of the Gold Coast. Many of Anvil's folk are directly or indirectly associated with ships and sailing. Sailors, ship owners, men made rich and poor by the sea trade, and the lonely wives of men who follow the sea. Arvena Thellus is an odd one. I've heard some strange noises coming from her basement. You too. Farewell. You wouldn't happen to be in the market for a home, would you? If you are, I just happen to be selling a manor located right here in Anvil. Yes, I'm selling my grandfather's house, Benaris Manor. If you're interested, I could let you have it for a modest sum. I have to sell it soon, as I have pressing matters elsewhere. You're welcome to take a look at it. It is located across the street from the chapel. Once you buy, you get the key to the front door and the deed of ownership. That's the deal. Would you like to buy it now? Well, I'll be here every day from noon until midnight. Let me know if you change your mind. Afternoon. I'm Wilbur, owner and proprietor of the Count's Arms. We make beds and food available to guests. Can I help you? Buildings here look different. Why? This is the Gold Coast style. Like in Hammerfell. Eastern towns look gray and dull to me. A local gentleman has been looking to sell his manor. A bit run down, but a magnificent place and price to move. The manor belongs to Velwyn Benarus. He's the one to speak to. Don't know if this is true, but I heard a gang of all female thieves is preying on the married menfolk of the town. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit you. What can I do for you? An all-female gang of thieves has been recently plaguing Anvil with a very unique method of robbing. They pick on only the men. If you want to help us do something about it, go talk to Gogan and Malona. Let's just say Gogan is intimately involved and leave it at that. Goodbye. How are you?
Good to see you. Hi there. I'm saving up enough for some medicine. May and Lorne and his brother run a nice establishment at the Flowing Ball. Thank you, kind lady. Let's hear it. What is it? Greetings. Let's hear it. Talk to me. I'm Dara Hill, steward of Castle Anvil. We do things differently in Anvil. And the difference shows in the comfort and trust of its people. The Countess deserves all the credit. I do things my way indeed, but she gives me the authority and support. I heard that Velwyn Benaris is trying to sell off Benaris Manor. Hopefully the new owners will clean that eyesore up. Good day. Hi there. I am Melona Umbranox, Countess of Anvil. I hope you enjoy your visit. I trust you will give us no cause to regret our hospitality to strangers. You can best know Anvil by walking its streets and speaking with its people. My favorite time is the harbor at sunset, the sun and sea to the west. Chancellor Okato has performed heroically. No one else could have held the Empire together during this crisis. He's a blessing on this town. The only one to have made any sense out of the terrible tragedy at the chapel. He preaches every day outside the chapel. Go and listen, you'll see. How did a dark elf become Count Shadenhall? 
King Helseth and Baranzia have considerable influence, and Helseth and Indaris are cronies. Get it? Goodbye. Oh, hello. listening. Greetings. I'm Thurindil, son of Julianos and Mohititona, queen of Akavir. These slugs climbing my spine itch something fierce. Like to dance? Mother's coming for me in the dragon ships. I don't like these itchy clothes, but I have to wear them or it frightens the fish. You hear about Gogan? A gang of thieves is running a scam in town, and he fell for it! <laughs> what an idiot! Bye. Oh, hello. Heard any news from the other provinces? I'm Krognak Robrock, landsman, and I don't much care who you are. You see a sailor in the streets of Anvil, best step out of his way. If it's in his mind to raise hell, a little jail time is just fair payment. Pinarus Inventius is quite the hunter. He can track about anything, and he's deadly with his bow. Goodbye. They call me Wilhelm the Worm, because dirt suits me fine. Town lets me live in the warehouse to keep out the rats. Nice friendly folk in Anvil. Even the Countess greets me in the street. Well, except for that Newheim the Portly. He's a mean old scrote. How about you? Not bad. Heinrich Okenhull, captain and shipmaster. My ship is in for refitting, so I'm high and dry for a while. Anvil wouldn't be my choice for a refit. No proper yard, neither spars nor scantlings in good supply. But it's ill luck to complain. Greetings, son. I'm Newheim, Anvil Harbor Master. 
I'm responsible for all harbor traffic, docks, duties, and fees in Anvil Harbor. Traffic through Anvil Harbor comes mostly in exotic, high-profit goods, easy to transport by road or Mages Guild couriers to eastern markets. Bye. I'm Mirabelle Monet. I run the Foxel, a boarding house for sailors. Sorry, I reserve my beds for seamen. Watch yourself around the Foxel. Sailors despise landsmen and won't hesitate to treat them to a good beating when they're in their cups. I swear that when I passed by Benarus Manor last night, I heard someone scream from inside. Velwyn Benarus will never sell that death trap. Don't mind him. He's not right in the head, poor fellow. Goodbye. I'm Norbert Lels. I let my merchandise speak for itself. Look around. If you see something you like, we'll talk about a price. Anvil's a port town. That's why you'll see items here you won't find in the Imperial City. The captains keep an eye out for special items for me. Mainland and his brother run a nice establishment at the Flowing Bowl. Let's do business. Farewell. How do you do? They say that when you murder someone, the Dark Brotherhood comes to you in your sleep. It's how they recruit new members. Are you sure? Of course. Heard any news from the other provinces? They... What do you want? Must have been knocked on the head. Talks all sorts of rot. Mika's a sheep, though. You too. How are you? You can say what you like, but I'm never going back to Kvach. You'll find him at the barricade at the top of the road. He's still trying to hold what's left of the guard together. I knew a priest named Martin once. I'm sure he's dead, just like the rest of them. They're all dead. Don't you understand? Goodbye. How are you? Greetings. I don't know you. You don't know me. Everybody's happy. It's a big town. Hell, it's a big county. You stick to your part, I stick to mine, all right? Don't know if this is true, but I heard a gang of all female thieves is preying on the married menfolk of the town. Good day. What is it? Welcome to the Flowing Bowl. I'm Mainlorn. My twin's name is Cainlorn. How to tell us apart? I'm in brown. He's in blue. Simple, really. The Count went missing about ten years ago. No one knows what happened to him. Lady Melona rules County Anvil. Her ladyship has no intention of remarrying. Liked her first Count well enough, I guess, and doesn't fancy a replacement. I've never read any of Quillweave's writings, 
I've heard they're fairly good, though. Be seeing you. I'm a soldier, mate. Not that it's any of your business. Why don't you just walk around and look for yourself? You need someone to explain everything to you? Crazy as a rat in a cat box. Just leave him alone. He's not hurting anybody. Take care. Hello there. Welcome to the Flowing Bowl. I'm Canelon, the one in blue. My twin, Mainlon, is the brown one. Best shops in Anvil? Norbert Lells handles rare books, exotic ingredients, and gems. And they have fine weapons at Morvane's Peacemakers. Mirabelle Monet is quite a woman. Ask any of the sailors down at the forecastle. Goodbye. Well met. I see you. Hello. This is a travesty. A complete and utter travesty. The crystal ball is just sitting there in the hold, but I'll be damned if I'm going back on board. And nobody will help me. Nobody. Not with those spirits roaming the decks. I don't suppose you'll help me. No, of course you won't. Of course you can't. Nobody ever wants to help. That's the... Wait, did you actually say you'd help me? Oh, how wonderful. I can't thank you enough. I've been going out of my mind ever since my crew was murdered. This is my ship, you see. The Serpent's Wake. I hired the crew to sail to Somerset Isle to retrieve a family heirloom. My mother's crystal ball. They made the journey and arrived back all right. But then, someone murdered them. All of them. Now their spirits are haunting the ship. The crystal ball is in a chest in the ship's hold, but I can't get to it. I made it as far as the captain's cabin, but the spirits nearly killed me. Get the crystal ball and return it to me here, and I'll make it worth your trouble. Here, you'll need this key. Thank you so much.
Hi, I'm Ulfgar Fogai, master of the Anvil Lighthouse. Visit the lighthouse anytime. Fine view of the town and harbor. Ships sail from Anvil Harbor for ports of call in Hammerfell, Somerset Isle, Yokuda, and the Western Isles. You too.